My faith helps me, you know, kind of just stay grounded and gives me strength to kind of just go on in, in, in my day-to-day -day life. Do this in memory of... We in our finitude are trying to reach him and his infinity. So any attempt at that is always going to be partial because we're, we're running after the ultimate truth. That's the cool part about the ghetto shul is that it's Orthodox people or people who come from an Orthodox background and a lot of people not as well. I don't come from an Orthodox background, but they want to approach it at their own level. No one's there because their mom, oh, did you go to services? Blah, blah, blah. They're there because they want to. Um, and I think that's the most beautiful part about the community, that people are there to make it there themselves. They're not being told to do it. The institution isn't creating it for them. We're creating it from the ground up. Any conversation and any people who are at the crux of suffering and injustice are people who deserve every ounce of energy that we can afford them. If you're fully focused in your prayer and you totally forgot and put everything aside, it's a very different peaceful feeling because you get to experience a one-on-one -on -one relationship with your Lord, with your Creator. And that's definitely something that can be expressed with words. Faith to me is, is part of my life, and so um, I, I take it wherever I am. Yeah, we, we do deal with a lot yeah. of stereotypes. We're here at McGill, you know, such a great university, and we're, we're here to learn, and for somebody to, to almost call you irrational, it's, it's, it's a pretty big <laughs> insult, I feel like, some of the time, but you learn to deal with it, and I don't think I've gone to that quite to that point yet where I, I can love everybody as I should, but I'm trying to get there. <laughs> I am a walking religion. It sounds very weird, but <laughs> like it does it is sound very weird, but it's true. Like you, I do portray my religion. I know I live it and I love sharing it because I love it. You know?